My name is Neil McNair. I'm president of the Partick Curling Club. Well, the club started in 1841. It wasn't the first club. The oldest club is actually Kinross, started in 1666. Uh, but by 1838, there was known to be 133 curling clubs throughout Scotland. The, the building we're sitting in just now goes back to 1901. Uh, a few years before that, the Provost Kennedy of Partick, and bearing in mind that Partick was a borough in its own right, was not part of Glasgow. And the, the Provost Kennedy provided the club with sufficient funds to build this clubhouse. And his two brothers provided funds to build two curling rinks outside of it. And so the clubhouse was opened in 1901 with the two rinks. The original rinks were actually from the front door of this building straight out to, uh, to where we are just now. Uh, at some time, a number of years later, the curling rinks were turned and we're now facing the motorway. Well, it's interesting to note, going back to the 19th century, how many times in the months of January and February that curling clubs were playing outside. I've been a uh, in this club for 15 years and the only time that we have been able to play outside was January 2010. Well, we really are very proud to have this pavilion. It's unique in the curling world this is the Partick Bell. It goes back to 1726. One of the rules about the bell is that it must not go outside the confines of the Partick Borough. And indeed, if anybody living out with the area wins the Partick Bell, then he must leave it in the borough itself. Each bell competition starts with the ringing of the bell, and we do hope that this bell will continue to ring for many, many years to come.